Okay, this is the review for Warm Desk Pad Oli Deek 3 Speed Touch Control Warm Big Mouse Pad. As you can see, I purchased this also on February 3rd, 2021, the same time I purchased this. Okay, so uh, this is the review of the pad. And if you watched my mouse review, which was the very first review in this series, uh, you'll know that I combined this winter. Uh, you know, I, I went all guns blazing. I, com I combined this heated pad with this mouse uh, heated pad and uh, this heated blanket, which I all got from Amazon. And I highly recommend getting all three if you just want to make sure you're toasty at the computer. I honestly can't rave about it enough. Like, even the blanket keeping my legs warm, it all adds to you being more warm. And it, it's just, it's absolutely phenomenal. So let's get to the review of this. So it's a little dirty here cause I've been eating food on it. Okay, and this is the plate. I put a hot plate down and made an, a marking but it did not damage the heat uh, pad, did not change how it uh, passed heat through. So um, as you can see, it's a pretty thin piece of kind of rubber kind of material. It's yay big, can fit a keyboard and a mouse pad, not just a mouse, but a mouse heated pad, which looks like a slipper for Bigfoot. And I'm gonna get right to it. This is a godsend. It works very, very well. Three settings. There's the plug, you plug it into the wall. You tap this ever so lightly, it's on red. Tap it again, it's on green. Tap it again, it's on blue. Blue is the lowest setting. I could not put this thing on red, even in the coldest days. If you watch my mouse review, the mouse pad review, I had the, I had the mat on yellow and the mouse on red, but never at any point did I have this mouse, uh, sorry, the keyboard mat, did I ever have that on red. It was too hot. It was too hot right here. Like it was toasty as all hell, but underneath the keyboard, what you'll start to learn is that it traps the heat. And sometimes I put my hand under the keyboard, I lift it up and as I'm browsing with my right hand, I'll keep my left hand underneath the keyboard and it keeps it nice and toasty. With the red setting, and honestly, sometimes with the yellow setting, sometimes with the yellow setting, but definitely with the red setting, it actually would burn. But I had to, I, the first time I, I experienced it, I pulled my hand out right away and I was like, yo, like that would actually burn me. It, it gets that hot, which is good because it works. That's good. I would rather it get more hot than not. Then you have something that kind of, kind of works. So I never use the red. I always, I would keep it on yellow in the, in the coldest days of the winter. And then we're in April right now. It's 10 degrees right now, but even like when it gets down to like five degrees at night, even five degrees at night here in April in Toronto, I still keep it on the blue setting. My hands are a little cold and just having this here, just resting my hand here, even just this part of my hand, it being warm, it actually warms up, goes up my arm. Like it's actually that useful. And then of course with the mouse pad, right? Like that warms up my hand. Like it's actually so very useful. Um, easy to clean, easy to wipe. It honestly goes just a little bit, maybe, maybe like here at the very edges, it doesn't get so hot or like no heat. And there's like a, a, a spot right here where sometimes heat doesn't go all the way, but literally any, everywhere else here, it gets so hot. It's crazy. So, um, there it is again, the uh, thing, the purchase that I made, and I, I highly recommend it. I cannot speak stamp of approval. I cannot speak more highly of this. Like it's it's so very useful, and I hope you get it. Uh, I, I I'm not making any money off this. This is just on my honest fucking whatever. All right, that's it. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Um, this is on my comedy channel slash maybe lifestyle channel. So if you want to like or subscribe, do that. And then I also have the best music blog on the internet. Uh, if you haven't heard of it, you will soon because it will be the biggest. I think so. 
Uh, it's called Tunes I Dig. It's linked in my channel as well. And uh, that's it. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time.